Joy. I'm a graduate student at KU and I work at the Natural History Museum. In this video, my coworker Anna and I are going to talk to you about Silvosaurus, a species of armored dinosaur that once lived in what is now Kansas. And we'll show you how to make your own armored dinosaur at home out of model magic and pasta. Isn't this so cool? This is a cast, or a model, of the skull of Silvosaurus chondrii. The fossilized skull, as well as ribs, spikes, vertebrae from the backbone, a leg, part of the pelvis, and other fossil bones were found in 1955 by cattle rancher Mr. Warren Condray and his 10-year-old son in Ottawa County, Kansas. Mr. Condray called in KU paleontologists to excavate and study the fossil, and based on its characteristics such as shoulder spikes, the shape of its head, its teeth, they were able to identify it as a new species of dinosaur. Specifically, it was recognized as a new species of Nodosaurus ankylosaur. Nodosaurs are very close relatives of ankylosaurs, but they had long tapering tails rather than the ankylosaur's club-like tail. Nodosaurs and ankylosaurs had bony plates embedded in their skin. That's what paleontologists mean when they refer to armor dinosaurs. The bony plates and the spikes on Silvosaurus made predators think twice about trying to eat it, and their shoulder spikes may have also been used in shoving matches among individuals fighting for territory or access to mates. Silvosaurus lived about 110 million years ago during the middle of the Cretaceous period in a densely forested area along the tidal shoreline of the Western Interior Seaway. Silvosaurus ate plants. This herbivore would use its triangular shaped teeth to pluck leaves from branches and to slice up plant matter. It was estimated to have been about 13 feet long and its head had large air passages that scientists hypothesized could have been used for communication. Now Anna is going to show us how to make nodosaurs out of model magic using pasta as the bony plates. Hi, this activity comes from paleontologist Dr. Victoria Arbor at the Royal British Columbia Museum, and we really appreciate her giving permission to show it during this discovery day. Here is what you'll need. A handful of model magic or Play-Doh, pasta in various shapes, such as bow tie and rotini and shells, and finally, markers for coloring your pasta. First, you'll want to make the body or shape of your nodosaur out of your model magic or play-doh. There are 27 different species of nodosaur. Pick which one is your favorite to model yours off of. You can't really go wrong. Because Silvosaurus is the only known dinosaur that once existed in what is now the state of Kansas, I am going to make a Silvosaurus. To make the stumpy legs, start by creating four small round balls of model magic, then attach the body to the legs. So as you can see here, I have made four little round balls and my body. And you're going to smooth the balls into the body so they stick. So like that. And your notosaur should be able to stand up. Then you need to start adding the pasta. Now, they had bony plates, as you can see, that were symmetrical on either side of its body, meaning that if you drew a line down the middle of its back, there would be the same number of bony plates on either side. You can see that in this toy. So what we're going to do is press the bow tie pasta to make the neck armor, and then you're going to put macaroni and rotini to make symmetrical sides on the back. So that means my neck plate fell off. So that means if I put macaroni on this side, I'm going to put macaroni on this side. And that means that if I put the rotini on say below the macaroni, and again, you might need to make yours a little bit bigger to fit more plates, I'm going to put rotini on this side as well. So once you have the bony plates and spikes aligned like you want, then you can color them different colors. You can make it as colorful as you want. 
make it all one color, to make a little design on them, maybe. But you're going to do something like that. And there you have your very own Nautosaurid Ankylosaur. Thanks for joining Joy and me today. Have fun watching the other videos throughout the day.